Tamika. I have a field scheduled for tomorrow and so I went to the store today to do a little prep work and get myself ready and that is one of my recommendations. If you know you have a field coming up, make sure that you have the things in your house that you need after your field and you're not scrambling trying to figure out um, how to comply with your rules after fill. So for me, uh, my rule is to do liquids for 48 hours and then go into mushies for a couple of days and then go back to eating. So I'll go ahead and share some of the things that I've picked up. I went to Trader Joe's and then I also went to um, another local store. So I picked up my all-time favorite, love this, Design Away um, Vanilla. It's 100 calories and 18 grams of protein. It mixes really, really well. Um, I just love that stuff. And so I decided to be outside my box. I usually don't like chocolate stuff, like chocolate um, protein powders and things like that. But today I decided to go ahead and pick up chocolate. Same thing, 100 calories per scoop gives you 18 grams of protein. Um, Let's see, some of the things that I'll be mixing that protein powder with is uh, my Oregon chai. I get the sugar free. I mix this with milk and one scoop of protein powder and I make myself sort of um, that remix chai latte that I've shared before. I also will take my protein powder and mix it in things like, let's see, here's some cream of wheat that I picked up. And this cream of wheat, it has 7 grams of protein in it, 6 grams of fiber, which is good. And let's see, I think it is only 140 calories if you mix it with water or 210 calories if, if you mix it with 3 fourths cup of uh, milk. So I think these are individual packets. I wouldn't be able to eat a whole packet, so I'll work out the calories later. Some of the other things that I picked up was um, some instant miso soup from Trader Joe's. I also got some, let's see, Latin style black bean soup, garlic, chipotle, and sea salt. That sounds pretty good. And I got some um, low sodium chicken broth. And I got the little uh, chicken sort of cubes to make some broth with. I did get a case of water and these waters from Trader Joe's. I like smart water, but I was there and figured, you know, oh well. So I got a case of these, 12 come in a case, and it's 50 ounces of water in this. So I figured with this, with some protein shakes, with some tea, um, I'll be able to get my liquids in for the day. But I'm shooting for at least getting one of those down. Of course, I got some more peanut flour. Love my peanut flour. I mix this with yogurt, and I'll show you some of the yogurt options that I picked up. My favorite um, go-to, it's a 0% fat. Uh, and for this, it's each cup of this is 20 grams of protein and 120 calories. So I'd only do half of this at a time, right? I also picked up some cottage cheese low fat I got low fat I didn't get the fat free because there's only 10 different 10 calorie difference between the no fat and the low fat and the low fat has a little bit more flavor for me so I figured I can sacrifice and live with just only 10 more calories same amount of protein everything else so I went with that for some beverage options, I got the vanilla and cinnamon black tea. I also got some candy cane green tea. Let's see, another thing that I picked up was, and this is new for me, I'm trying this for the first time. Now, I didn't get this from Trader Joe's, I got this from a local store. But it's the probiotic soy ochre. Um, and the reason why I got this was, look what it says. We know we need that, right? Um high fiber and unsweetened so <laughs> and for this it's 170 calories for one cup so again shooting for half of that and 11 grams of protein but I got a fix for this I like the yolk I like the fact that it has the fiber in there and I will put some peanut flour in it 
and I will also put some agave nectar in it. So that's my plan for that. Some more things that I picked up. This um, uh, Athenos has this, and I also found this at um, Walmart, but I picked this up at my local store. So I got honey, strawberry, and peach, and all of these are, um, they're really good. They're like, uh, let's see, 11 grams of protein and 100 calories. So those are pretty good. And again, I've added peanut flour to just about any yogurt. I've also added it to cream of wheat. I add it to oatmeal sometimes. When I'm in need of extra protein, this is my go-to item. It, it does not have an overwhelming peanut taste. It mixes really well. Remember, this is only pure peanuts. Um, nothing else is added and it's just, you know, it's easy to mix. So if you, if you don't mind peanuts, you want some uh, protein, that's a good way to get it. Some more things I picked up. These are just fun uh, right after a fill. Typically, my stoma is a little irritated, so if I just want something to sort of just sip on, these apple sauces from Trader Joe's are good. And I also got some unsweetened applesauce. Now, remember, it says unsweetened. It still has sugar in it because it's the natural sugar from uh, the apples. Let's see. Oh, I told you about my chai already. Oh. Now, soup. I want to make a soup. Was in the store. Wanted to do something different. So Trader Joe's picked up this bag of broccoli and cauliflower. Also picked up uh, this container, this little package of trim leeks. And I got a pack of chicken. I don't need much. So these are just some chicken legs. Of course, I'm going to take the skin off of it before I boil it. But my idea is boil the chicken to death until it falls off the bone. Cut up the leeks, the broccoli, and the cauliflower and blend this together. Put some seasoning, probably my 21 a seasoning salute from Trader Joe's. Love that. doesn't have any salt in it, but it has lots of uh, different flavor. So that is going to be the soup that I'm going to this week. Let's see. I also found some... Um, Nicole talks about this all the time. I found it in a store the other day, posted a picture of it on Facebook. And if you guys um, aren't connected with me on Facebook, please do so because I'm, you know, all throughout the day taking pictures of stuff when I'm at the grocery store or talking about what I'm eating, talking about um, different recipes and things like that. So again, I am Tamika Bryant and I am WL. WLS Coach Tamika on Facebook and I also have a Facebook fan page now which is Lap Band Success Coaching so if you want to go ahead and check that out please do so but back to this found this love it it is um, only 45 calories 8 grams of protein for one cup now before this, my go-to milk items were Smart Balance Fat-Free, which has uh, some antioxidant vitamin C and E in it, 25% more calcium, 25% more protein. And I also like the Smart Balance um, Heart Right Fat-Free. has some omegas in it, vitamin E, um, you know, things like that. So when I get milk most of the time I try to get the smart balance but I think moving forward I will be sticking with the hood Cali countdown so this is it guys I'm getting ready for my fill and um, you know I always say you got to have a plan you can't go at this whole situation blindly you have to have a plan it's very 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 important don't go out get a fill then come home and you're starving and then you you know you want to just eat whatever is there and whatever is available just make sure that you're being very strategic about your weight loss success all right i'll catch you guys later bye